So, these guys, they talk about how Martin Luther King was very successful, and uniforms had nothing to do with that. But Martin Luther King wore school uniforms when he was in, in school, so how do we know that, that had nothing to do with it? Um, and also, there's still a dress code when you're not in the dress down day. Like, if you wear something inappropriate, you're going to get a detention. And, uh... Uh, so uniforms are cheap and easy. So for far less fortunate families, it would be a lot easier than having to buy <coughs> the children more clothes. And uh, school uniforms would eliminate social separation because the clothing is a huge factor of every, of how you judge someone. So the bullying rates would go down because it eliminates the factor of being bullied of what you wear. And how can you compare this school to a school in downtown Philly? People get shot almost every day down there. So, it's different. And is it, you, if you find one option of the uniforms not flattering, you can choose another type of uniform that you find more flattering. And... School uniforms are economical, cheap, and an easy way to make students' grades go up. Because if students aren't worried about what outfit to wear to school, they become more worried about the work that was needed to do to be done during the week. Think about it. With the way stu some students dress, they can get severely ridicule ridiculed. With uniforms, that would be eliminated. Your choice. Cool shirts or good grades. Thank you.